Previously on Pokemon Sword. Once you get around wind on you've come to the right flying taxi. League staff Isaac. Okay, it's a grass and electric type more Grass and Electric Rodom. Rodom catalog. Use the catalog to have Rodom hop in and out of the various devices listed within. I see. Can hop. Yeah, sure. Go check my gym badges. Hello, YouTube. Welcome back to my Pokemon Sword Let's Play series. And here we are standing just a few steps and we are going to compete in the semi finals. So. Who's on my team? We have Grodd, Mr. Rhyme, Colossal, Terzing, Berserker, and Kindred No. I have Amulet Coin for Grodd just for the just so we can earn twice the Poké Dollars. And this primary role will be a pivot. And then here we have Mr. Rhyme as our special wall. I'm I'm having him hold light clay to increase the turn for reflect. Then here we have Colossal for type coverage and to set up stealth rocks. He also has rapid spin in case. And then here we have Sir Zing, Galarian Wizzing, as our physical wall. And I also have leftovers for this guy. I also have I also let Colossal hold the leftovers because he doesn't have any way of recovering. And then here we have Berserker. As our wall breaker, I have him hold the choice band. Not really the best choice, but I believe it can still do lots of damage combined with tough claws and then just use just iron head our way to victory. Tough claws but tough claws plus choice band plus that insane high attack stat, I'm sure it can deal lots of damage. Then here we have Kindred, no? For type coverage as well. Anyway, so let's head in. I'm not sure how this is going to go. We'll see. I knew you'd get all the badges and meet me here. I know that there's been a lot between us. What with my big brother, Team Yell helping, Spike Moth and all that. But the truth is, when all said and done, I really just want to become champion for myself. So don't take it personal when I kick your butt. Okay, so our first match is going to be against Marnie. Is it safe to say that this is going to be a 6v6 battle? Oh, she has five Pokemon. Only five? Lipard. Starting with Lipard. Dark type. I gotta win this if I'm gonna be the champion. Okay. I think Grodd can take this Pokemon. Let's go with Drum Beating. No need to use your turn. Okay, good. Are we actually over leveled? Toxic rope. Are quite over leveled. Oh well. Okay, against Toxic rope. I'll use U turn. And switch to. Who do we have? I can't use Berserker since Toxic rope is poison and fighting type. Zing. Colossal. Nope. Uh huh. Okay, so my team is quite weak against fighting types. Kindred, No Perserker, Colossal, Mr. Rhyme are weak against fighting types. Uh, let's just go. Let's just go with Zerzing and 
use Willow Wisp. Okay, good. Use Toxic. Wizzing is immune against it because he's also a poison a poison type. Then let's try to cripple it with Willow Wisp. Wait, Venusaur is special. Hmm. I guess Toxic Rock has a mixed move set. Anyway, let's go with Strange Steam. Should it should do neutral damage. Swagger. Okay, that's not really good for Wizzing. Wonder if it has any fighting type move. Well, I think Surzin can take care of it. No need to switch. Just one more strange steam. Oh, okay. She used the full restore. Wasn't expecting that early. Okay. Did they grind too much? I thought that trainers here are going to be at a much higher level than my Pokemon. Anyway, let's just make our way to finals. More Peko? Already? Super effective. Hmm. Dark type? Okay, Torment. That won't allow us to use Strange Steam consecutive. Okay, I'm just one hitting. I just one hit more Peko. I think I'm just breezing my way. <laughs> Scrafty. Fighting type and dark type. Let's go with Willow Wisp. And my Wizzing is even faster. Swagger again. Well, she sure does like dark type and fighting type Pokemon. Any other moves besides Swagger? We'll see. Wizzing not hitting himself due to the confusion is really great. RNG is on my side. Damn. Wizzing just sweeping through her Pokemon. I've got everyone's cheers back in me. I'm really, really gonna win this time. Got it? Okay. Grim Snarl. Dark type and fairy type. I think she's gonna Dynamax. I definitely feel she's gonna Dynamax, so. Let's Dynamax as well. And just Max Starfall. It's going to be her last Pokemon, so. I'm sure she will. Let's end things with Wizzing. I think this is the first time I am Dynamaxing this guy. <laughs> okay, I'm right. Gigantamax? Wait, Grimmsnarl has a different form? Wow. Alright, let's see how tough it is. Okay, Weezing still moves first, but still confused. Okay, good job. Don't let confusion affect you. 
Whoa! <laughs> Does a lot of damage. Meeting sure is not holding back. Max Starfall as well. You have the advantage here. Oh well. Wait, no! <laughs> Where did I use that? Anyway, still super effective. Yes, we got over leveled. We did good, Marnie, to get this far. Okay, so I lost. But I got to see a lot of the good points of view and your Pokemon. And we got 15,000 thanks to Amulet Coin. Everyone in the stadium was watching us during all that. I heard them cheering for me and my Pokemon. It was nice. I may have lost, but at least we drove the audience wild. Yes, that's not so bad. I think I'll join my brother in the stands. And we'll watch from the sidelines to see who ends up challenging the champion. Just so you know. I still haven't decided if I'm gonna cheer for you. See ya. Kindred. I'll be waiting for you in the final match. After seeing the way you battle, I can't accept any outcome besides winning this match. My team is on fire. Is this single Elims? Single Elims, I suppose. Pardon me. I know we didn't get a long break, but the match before yours ended more quickly than expected. Challenger Hop won quite handily, so as soon as you're ready, we'd like to we'd like you back on the pitch. How about my Pokemon? Did you heal them? Okay. We're still gonna go with this. Wait, I think we can switch. I think we can switch. Hmm, Orbital. Let's use Orbital instead of Mr. Rhyme and then. Gyarados. Wait. Ingenos still didn't get to battle, so let's stay. Then switch. Madame Duck for. Switch Berserker for Madame Duck. Just so we won't be weak against fighting types. Orbital and the damn duck can resist fighting type. Let's go, should be good. Who's going to be our next match? Wait. I'm not sure if the switch with the damn duck is correct. Who are we going to fight next? Oh, okay, it's Hop. I thought it was going to be against Bid, if ever. <laughs> I just had this sort of flashback, you know? Remember? Back when we were still in Postwick. When we got our Pokemon from Lee that day, I never would have dreamed that I'd end up standing here, facing you of all people. But it's time I finish what was started that day. Got it? The one who'll become champion is me! Alright, let's see what you got, Hop. See how far you have improved. This is going to be our final match against you. Our final battle against you. Double. Okay. Still have it, I see. I'm gonna go with Gord right from the start. Um this Pokemon is normal type, right? I think Grodd can do just okay. So we're gonna stick with them. Go for drum beating. Well, we can use user anytime. Okay, body slam. Grodd gets paralyzed. Oh, no. Okay. Let's continue using drum beating. Full restore. Already?
gonna keep on using drum bearing until it faints. All right, that does it. It's going to be our next one, or V Knight. Great Pokemon to choose against Grodd. I have no way of dealing with it, so I'm gonna switch using U turn. Deal a bit of damage and switch to hmm, or Knight. Switch to Colossal. Corviknight is still and flying type. And both of Colossal types resist it. Let's use Stealth Rock. I don't think he plans to switch anyway. Oh, I still win those neutral damage because of Colossal's Fire type. Because of Colossal being a Fire type Pokemon too. Okay. Now with Stealth Rock, let's go with Hit Crash. Okay, thanks for the Swagger. That will increase Colossal's attack a lot. Now, we can only hope that it doesn't hit himself. Hit himself. <laughs> Guess because we keep on using Steel Wing. It's his only option anyway. Okay, so we're just gonna keep on hitting yourself, Colossal. Are you just gonna stay as a stealth rock setter? Still being missed. Alright, time to sweep. You knew I'd be aiming for a super effective hit, but you still didn't switch. Should have switched Pokemon Hop. Oh, we still have Snorlax. Interesting. We're gonna keep on going with Colossal. Okay, Heat Crash is based on the weight. And Snorlax is really heavy, so its power will be really low. So let's just go with let's just go with Rock Slide. Snorlax may have high HP, but it has low defense. Okay. High horsepower. Almost... Almost fainted Colossal. Are we gonna sweep? Are we gonna sweep with Colossal? Switch to your starter Pokemon. You refuse, I see. Pinkerchin. What is this Pokemon type anyway? Again? Uh, forgot. But Rock Slide and Hit Crash is effective, so. Let's go with Hit Crash. I believe that Pokemon's weight is really low. Okay, one hit. Colossal on the roll. I think you got me back into a corner. Okay, Inteleon finally. Wait, one Pokemon left. I'm sure it's he's going to Dynamax that Inteleon. Anyway. I'll save my Dynamax for Grodd. Or Kindred, no. Wait. Or Orbital. Got or Orbital. 
I will let Colossal faint. Release all the thoughts poured into my wishing star. Time for Dynamax. This will be the first time I'm going to see Intellion as Dynamax. It's gonna move first, I'm sure. Max Gazer. Oh well. You did good, Colossal. You did good. Okay. That will cause the stadium to rain. That will cause that will cause rain in the stadium. Uh-huh. Orbital surging. Let's go with a starter battle. You are Dynamax, so I'm also going to Dynamax Rod. I wonder if you have any ice type moves. How prepared are you against battling Rillaboom? Do I go first? Okay, Max Hellstorm, nice. I'm sure you can withstand it, Rod, right? Okay, that's going to change into Hail from from rain to hail. Anyway, did good up. Huh? Really unfortunate that I am at a much higher level. Okay, Sir Zing now level 55. And that's it. That's our final battle against Hop, I think. <laughs> Kindred, thanks, mate. I'm really glad you were the one here with me. Got 11,000. Did good, Hop. You did good making it this far. And the victor of the semi-finals, the challenger who has won their way through all of the many hopeful trainers in the gym challenge is... Challenger Kindred! You know, even when Sonia was saying that you and me looked like we could become heroes, I really never felt like one. But you, mate, I think maybe you really could do all sorts of great things. Good on you, Kindred. And Rilla Boom and all the rest of your team. It's so our next battle is going to be against Lee or not yet not yet Kindred that was incredible brilliant honestly there were even tears rolling down my face before I knew it to think that the two of you set out together from the same town built up the greatest teams and arrived here at this point to throw everything you had at one another that burning desire to win. Those moves filled with undefeatable passion. It was battling at its very purest. In every possible way. Even though there were some trainers who weren't sure whether you were fit to be endorsed for the gym challenge at first. That was you, Lee? Well then, all the more reason. My team members and I will give everything that we've got in us to defeat our challenger. And the challenger standing before us might well end up being you, Kindred. In fact, that's precisely what I'm hoping for. That's right, Kindred. The real challenge is what's coming next. And I'm completely exhausted. I just want to head back to the hotel and rest. Best refill your energy stores first. Why don't we go get some dinner together? I wouldn't say no, but... Never care at all what food tastes likely. A night like this deserves more than rubbish takeaway, so at least pick something good.
and done. That's our last battle against Marnie and Hop. Maybe? Or maybe we'll still meet them along the way, somewhere. Oh, are we going to get interviewed? Got some time for questions. First question. Ask me, but you're already at the first question. <laughs> We and Challenger Hop were both endorsed by the champion, making the two of you rivals in a sense, wouldn't you say? How does it feel to have defeated your rival? I'm glad I could beat him. Doesn't quite feel real yet. It was just luck that I won. <laughs> I think let's go with this. Doesn't quite feel real yet. Right, question number two. I mean, it feels weird asking me while Hop is beside me. If you want to tell Challenger Hop something right now, what would it be? I thank him for the great match. I tell him how strong he was. That he was just the rival I knew he was. I think this is the best answer. He was just the rival I knew he was. Question 3. Level with me, kiddo. Honest thoughts here. I think you can win the finals too. Now we're gonna go with absolutely do, of course. <laughs> Alright, that's enough. Kindred is already tired from battle. And you've been asking rather rude questions. We've got ourselves dinner plans with my brother. So, sorry, but clear off already, would you? Yes, yes, I understand. Looking forward to seeing the birth of a new star. Oh, thanks for that, Hop. Both of us are hungry. <laughs> Phew, famous people sure have it rough, eh? I hope Lee gets here soon. I could eat my own arm about now. <laughs> Several hours later and Lee is still not here. This is absurd, even Lee's never late never this late. Something's not right. Always does what he says he'll do. As a kid he promised me he'd become champion one day, and he went and did just that. He ought to be able to keep to his own dinner plans. What was the problem? Oh, it's Pyres. Kids sure got him out on him, huh? If you were that noisy during battle, you'd unleash a whole new level of power, you know? Oh, pack it in, Pyres. I'm seriously worried here. I don't need to see your smug mug looking like you're having a go at me. Even though you act like you're giving me a good advice. Judging by appearances, no wonder you lost to your mate. If you're looking for the champion, I saw him, re I saw him head into Rose Tower. Uh huh. Rose Tower? Not familiar. Don't know what he's up to, but I ran into him at the monorail platform. Okay. He said to tell you he He said to tell you that he had something to do at Rose Tower so he'd be late to your dinner. But why Rose Tower? What could he have to do there at this hour? Fires, do us a favor, take us to Rose Tower, would you? Neither Kindred nor I know the way. Shh What rude siblings? Always so demanding of others. So I suppose it's a real problem for me, too, if the finals are held up for any reason. And I don't really hate the two of you little runts. You were good enough to beat me after all. So I think I'll invite Team Yell along, and we'll all have ourselves a bit fun, shall we? Brilliant! You're the best, Spires. Let's go make a real ruckus. Hey, what about, what about dinner? Guys, I'm hungry. I wanna eat. Wait, I have a feeling I need. Eh, maybe later. Okay, what now? Okay, Marnie's also here. Man, why am I here for this? I'm totally exhausted from that battle with you, Kindred. We decided that Team Yell will cheer you on, Kindred. Let's help out together. Oh, thanks. But is Marnie willing to cheer for me? <laughs> what a beautiful display of sibling love. However, it is entirely unnecessary. Hmm, what are you doing here, Oliana? Chairman roasts with the champion in a very, very important meeting. There is no way I will let anyone interfere. What? 
After all, only authorized personnel with the proper key can ride the monorail to Rose Tower. That means as long as Chairman Rose is in the tower, no one can disturb him. I have hand selected a member of the Lich staff and given them a key. Chairman Rose does enjoy this kind of menial games after all. You think you can tell the difference between normal league stuff and the one I chose? Do you think you can find me? Is it based on the glasses you were? I think it's based on the glasses. What should we do? This isn't good, but I got this one. Injured, Team Yells, Yelin will handle this. No, this is brilliant. I'll search around the front of the stadium. What do we do? For now, we should try to head to the plaza together, right? Okay. Alright, let's all work together and head for Rose Tower. Let's find Oliana's League staff member. That bad one was wearing those lame shades, right? Right. Okay, time to look for him. It's not this one. What do you think, Marnie? Talking to me ain't gonna help you find the bad guy now, is it? I'll show you on. So go out there and track him down. Because it's faster if you use the bike. Not this one. Why aren't you looking? It's you, isn't it? It's you. <laughs> Uh, hold up. Let me switch Grod and Kindred now. I know it's you. Hey Kindred, this bloke's awfully shifty. But I can't get him to turn around. See something surprising so that he'll have no choice but to look this way. I guess we should say we already have the key, you know. <laughs> Time for a Pokemon battle. Macrocosmos Eric? Macrocosmos? Meow. Okay, Galarian Meow. We'll do just fine. Okay, good job. We're going to be your next. Do run. My cheers will really get you going. Thanks for the help. Let's just say thanks. <laughs> oh, nice! Speed rose sharply. Thank you, Marnie. Thank you for cheering for me. But where is Sonia? Where is Sonia to cheer for me? <laughs> Just finish it. Don't suddenly talk to me like that. I accidentally turned around. Now hand over the key. All I need to do is hide, and I won't have to give you the key. What? Again? He ran this way, so... Hmm. Maybe here? Nope, not here. Is he still in the plaza? Where'd he go? Maybe here? Did he go inside one of the stores? Yeah, I think we should talk to Pyres. 
see if he has any info. Or Marnie. Hmm. Okay. Nope. No info from Marnie. Seems like nobody's seen that bad league staff member anywhere else. I bet they're hiding somewhere nearby. Somewhere nearby. In the Pokemon Center? Or here? Let's check the Pokemon Center first. Nope, not in the Pokemon Center. Nearby. Maybe here? Hmm, not here. Maybe here? Did they go inside? Is he here? Nope. <laughs> Where are you? Where are you? Not here. Where'd he go? This is no longer nearby. Anyway, let's still check. Maybe he's inside here. Nope, nothing here. Okay, maybe he is... I think I know where to find him. Perhaps here. Nothing. Alright, where is that guy? Where'd he go? Maybe here? Shouldn't be able to run here. Oh boy, where'd he go? Not here. Do we check each house? It's just nearby according to Team Yell. Did he go here? Wait, no. <laughs> Around Windon Monorail Terminal. Windon Monorail Terminal. Terminal. Wait, so he is inside here. This is the terminal. Windon Monorail Terminal. Hmm? Let's go... Uh... Where'd he go?
I seriously have no idea on where to look. Maybe here? Not here? Not here. Let's try talking to people. Hmm. Also not here. Maybe here? Nope. Where are you? Let's talk with the other team YAL members or the other league staff. I wear this bad league member stuff, I just lose the sunglasses. Right. Wait, what is just here? Okay. Drop pain to find. My well. Change your Pokemon in just short amount of time. Level 47. gonna do initial damage because of water side let's go defense and special defense rose sharply nice I love how the cheers from team Yell and Marnie are increasing my stats Colossal wants to learn the move Rock Blast Nah, I'll stick with Rock Slide. Excadrill. Visual damage. Rock against Rock just does visual damage. Okay, they say hide a tree in the forest, so I thought I could hide myself in the crowd. Now we're gonna hide again. Okay, let me first switch. Grod. Or... Gyarados. Or Beetle, okay. Or Beetle can stay there. Just keep on using Kindred. So where'd you go this time? Disappeared again. Where'd he go this time? Maybe he is just in that area. Makes sense for a cornered person to seek out the tightest hiding place, I guess. Don't suppose you got a box lying around? Makes sense for a cornered person to seek out the tightest hiding place. Box lying around. Hmm. Not here. 
Where'd he go this time? This? Oh, okay, here. <laughs> You're way too observant, but I'll win this time and make my getaway. Just hand over the key, please. Pharisee, the pre evolution of uh, Ferrothorn? It's not moving an inch. Wait. Oh, not very effective because of its grass typing. Iron Barb's gonna hurt Kindred now. go with crunch we should be able to take it down with crunch yeah have some of my support I know you can keep the beat going let's go with you're the best Marnie <laughs> second special attack grows sharply iron barbs gonna hurt kindred now again I hope his next Pokemon isn't fast. Felix! Not fast, but it's really bulky. Hmm. Let's see. We got our attack stat increased by two stages, so there we go. Finish the battle. Okay, finally. Hand over the key. You're gonna run again? I'm tired of this running. <laughs> Seems like you've got me cornered, but I'm not going to give up. An earful from Miss Oliana is way worse than anything you lot can do. Good luck catching me on the monorail. Seriously? Another chase? Team Yell, go find Hop. We'll corner that League Stuff member at the station together. Can I heal or no? What? What? <laughs> they are guarding it? Let's battle each one of them. You did a cracking job of cornering that bad League Stuff member, Kindred. Let me sing you a song feeling of your rocking deeds. The only thing a humble singer can do is sing a humble song. What? <laughs> is this going? <laughs> Why is he doing a street performance? I think you mean a station performance. Come on, let's see if we can get closer. Ooh, so that's his plan. Get the attention of everybody in the station. <laughs> Even the zigzagoons are dancing. Ooh. <laughs> okay, no need to battle all of them. Got a key spires, we can take the monorail to Rose Tower now. Thank you, Pyres, for the help. Time to see what Lee's on to. Let's go, Marnie. Hmm, what do we have here? Very consistent of three party members. This is a Final Fantasy game. <laughs> so what should we do? Team Yell is gonna have their hands full holding up those bad leagues staff members. They won't be catching up anytime soon. Yeah, Kindred, what should we do? Let's go ahead. Without him, there's no champion for you to challenge in the Champion Cup. Kindred, you cleared the way to Rose Tower. Now all you gotta do is charge on ahead. An employee is an employee, I guess. Seems that exec lady hit the monorail key to try and impress the chairman. Chairman Rose has been keeping the champion hold up inside. Wonder what he's planning. 
times like this when tension and passion run high, it reminded me of Spike Moth in the old days. Some right wild concerts we had back then. But no... Wait, you're still here? Better get going, I'll send some support your way with a yell. Gotta stick around to make sure my bro doesn't do anything too crazy, right? Come back if you need anything. So let's go hop. Anyway, this episode will be ending here, guys. We'll see what's gonna happen in our adventure for the next one. See you and thank you for watching.